ولقد جات رسلنا ابراہیم بل بشرا قالو سلاما قال سلام فما لبس ان جا بجل حدیث ناؤ پلیز نوٹ دی پوائنٹ ہیئر ہیئر حضرت ابراہیم علیہ السلام از بینگ مینشنڈ اینڈ یو نو دی دی سیکوینس از حضرت نو حضرت ہود حضرت صالح علی ابراہیم بٹ یو فائنڈ اے ویری بیسک ڈفرینس دی اسٹائل از ایبسولیوٹلی ڈفرینٹ نتھنگ اباؤٹ واٹ ہیپن ٹو ہز نیشن واٹ واز از کال ٹو دی نیشن اینڈ یو نو واٹ دی نیشن ریسپونڈیڈ The style is absolutely different. Only an incident regarding, you know, the angels which were sent by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for the destruction of the city of Sodom and Gomorrah. Before going there, they visited Hazrat Ibrahim alayhi salam and they gave him the glad tidings of his son to be born to Hazrat Sarah salam alayha. Now this is the only thing here. So it's a very big difference. It must be noted. What is the connotation? That I am not going to discuss, you know, because in this rapid translation, these things cannot be discussed in detail. But you have to note the difference, and you know, you ponder yourself, maybe you reach the same conclusion. <coughs> and our messengers, that is the angels, but they were in the guise of human beings. They came to, Isra- to Ibrahim with a glad tiding. Qalu salama. They said, Salam, Salam alaikum. Qala salamun, he returned Islam, the greeting. Wa alaikum as-salam, fama labis anja bi'idlin. He didn't delay even a minute, but he went to his household and brought a roasted calf. Anja bi'idlin hanees. Falamma ra'a adiyahum. Now he placed that calf, roasted calf, before these guests. But when he saw their hands not moving toward that calf, They were not, no extending their hands toward it. Nakirahum. Now he became suspicious. Who are they? Wauja saminhum khifa. And he felt, you know, conceived some fear in his heart. Because, you know, in those tribal days, it was the custom, you know, if somebody or some people went to do some harm to others, they won't eat from their house. At least they were so noble. To whom we are going to kill, And the home, you know, we are going to rob or, you know, whatsoever. They do, at least don't, don't eat from their house. So when Hazrat Ibrahim saw that he had not ready to eat, how does Amin Hum Khifa? And he find that they, maybe there are some enemies and they have come to do some harm to me. Qalu la takhaf. They said, don't feel any fear. Inna ursilna ila qawmi lood. We have been sent. to the people of Lut. Vamratuhu qaimatun and his wife, Hazrat Sarah, salamun alayhi, was also standing, might be standing behind some curtain. Fazahikat, she laughed. What happened to my husband, you know? He became fearful of these guests and, and this, something else now has come out. There are no enemies. Fazahikat, she laughed. Fabashnaha bi ishaq. These messengers gave her The glad tidings of the son, that is Ishaq. Wamin bara Ishaq a Yaqub. And not only of the son, but also of the grandson. After Ishaq, after him, a grandson, Yaqub. Qalat ya wa ilata aledu wa ana ujudun wa hada bali shaykha. She said, woe unto me. Shall I bear a child? And when I am so old a woman, and this my husband is also very old. In Nahada Allah Shayyu Nadeeb, this is a very strange thing, what you are telling. Qalu wa ta'jabina min amrillahi rahmatullahi wa barakatuhu alaykum ahl al-bayt. They said, O oh, people of the house of Ibrahim alayhi salatu wa salam, are you wondering about the command of Allah? He can do anything. This old age of yours or old age of your husband is no bar to him. Inna hu hamidun majeeb. Verily, he is self-praised or praiseworthy. You can translate Hamid in two ways. Praiseworthy or self-praised. One who doesn't need any praise, who is above praise. Majid and he is glorious. Falamma zahaban Ibrahim and Rawr, when this fear had departed from Ibrahim, wajaathul bushra, and now the glad tiding came to him. 
Then what will you have? Okay, of 45 also. If 45 are there, we shall spare the city. And so on. It came to even 5. But then, you know, final word in Torah is also the same, which is now appearing. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the Quran is cutting long story short. So he left all those details, but they are given in there, disputed. He was Yudha de Lona. He was arguing us. And you know, he was asking for forgiveness for that nation. In my Ibrahim, Verily, Ibrahim was forbearing Halim. Avahun always invoking him. Munib always turning towards him. Ya Ibrahim aridan hada. But in the end it was said to him, Oh Ibrahim, now just leave it alone. Innahu qadjaru rabbik. The command of your Lord has already come. Wa innahum atihim azabun ghayrum al mardud. And now, to them is going to come the punishment which cannot be averted, which cannot be returned. 